All right, this is the uh, Ant Miner um, S7. This is the beast. This is the uh, 4.8 giga hash. Um, I'm sorry, 4.8 tera hash. 1240 watt from Bitmain um, batch one. This is batch one. And it took forever. Yeah, he actually emailed him like, hey, where the hell is my product? It is uh, late until October right now. It is uh, October the 19th. I was supposed to get this around the first week in October. Um, they emailed me and was like, oh, quality control. These ant miners aren't passing. Of course, it's my trusty unboxer. Ant miner. Hopefully, this is what. Oh, okay. Here we go. Boom. Bitmain. Um, little information there. Addresses, blah, blah, blah. Oh, it's small. I thought it'd be bigger. This is my first Ant Miner. I don't plan on buying more of these. Um, I plan on just going long into Bitcoin. But uh, this, this thing is light. And it's compact. And just a little add-on. I actually got the whole package. I got the, uh, the power. Supply recommended by Bitmain. I got the uh, 1600 watt single power supply as well um, from Bitmain. This came in really fast. This took forever. So, this is an unboxing, but we're going to be going through in depth on how to set this beast up. And I've never, oh, probably don't want to put it on there. Let's open this bad boy up. All right. Now, these guys told me that they were having problems passing QC. So, and I was going to get like a special something. Um, which I'm not seeing anything. As you can see, this is the S5, S7 from Bitmain, Ant Miner S7, S7 there. All right, so this thing, uh, this thing is robust. All right, so this thing is nice. I'm guessing it's it's actually a little heavier than that I think about it. It definitely looks like it's meant to be slid and locked in with other uh, ant miners. So we're gonna figure out how to set this thing up and uh, get her going. There's so many leads on here. Um, like there's so many. Guessing uh, it's two, four, six, and then boom, boom. So all of them. So pretty much just pretty much plug and play on this bad boy. But I do know a little bit about it. I, I know you gotta start the fans or something first. And I'm gonna I'm gonna take a look and go in depth on it, but. Right now, I gotta do a lot of reading, a lot of research. This is gonna be a, a multi-part series. I'm an amateur. I usually just buy Bitcoin straight off the bat, but this thing was such a beast. Literally, even if the the block is uh, split in half to 12.5, I guess I'll just let this this puppy run. But I will not buy more of these because it just wouldn't be profitable. But just one of these, just going, you know, a couple hundred bucks a month profit just uh, that's after electricity electricity is pretty cheap uh, it's like four cents a watt so that makes it more feasible to continue mining but <clears throat> can't wait to set this up there is literally nobody out there with this setup this setup in their home uh, mining 
Um, maybe there's a reason for that. I don't know. But we're gonna we're gonna see. This is gonna go in the basement. Um, we have the. Uh, this is I'm in the U.S. So this is um, gonna be uh, 240 volts. We're gonna have a dedicated breaker just for the hell of it. You know, a couple hundred bucks. The electrician, I'm not doing this. The electrician's gonna come out. I'm gonna videotape that. And then um, we'll get, get this puppy set up. Uh, only thing I'm missing right now is the rack. Something that like a steel rack to just sit it on, which is easy to buy, Home Depot. And then, um, and then we're gonna be, uh, the networking part should be pretty simple. I feel like I could just set this up to my router right next to my office, my desk. But I'm guessing this thing is loud as hell. And I don't want it next to me when I'm trying to work. Um, but I might, I might just mess around with it and just throw it up here real quick and see what it sounds like. Just for initial setup. That's probably what I'll do. I'll do initial setup here and then I'll, um, well, the power issues is we, I don't have, all my um, stuff up here is 120 volts. So you're gonna, you need minimum 200 volts, 205 volts on this beast so and so I guess these are the instructions so I'm gonna do a little bit of reading it does come with some instructions um, let's see what happens stay tuned next video coming soon this is the amp miner s7 from bitmain with the 1600 watt power supply you only need one to power this one um, 4.8 tera hash ant miner, um, we're probably talking about you know a couple bitcoins a month with this, you know after the block splits. Right now we're probably talking about maybe uh, yeah we're probably talking about two or three coins per month with this.